This video will show you how to download, install, license, and open SPSS statistics on a Windows computer. When you've placed your order and received the email from Hearn Software, you'll be directed to a page like this, where you can watch a video with step-by-step -step installation instructions, and also select which SPSS installer file you need to download. There are options for both Mac and Windows. This video is for Windows users. There's a separate video if you have a Mac. SPSS statistics will only install on 64-bit Windows operating systems. Select the Windows download by clicking here. Agree to the terms and conditions and then choose I'm not a robot. Then click Submit. I'm using the Google Chrome browser. You can see the download starts in the bottom left-hand corner here, and you can access the download section at any time by clicking on the three dots in the top right here and choosing Downloads. The Firefox browser will ask if you want to save the file. Choose Save File and the download starts in the Downloads section of the browser. You can return to this section at any time by clicking up here. If you're using the Microsoft Edge browser, you'll be asked if you want to open or save the installation file. Choose Save As, then select your Downloads folder, and then press Save. You can see the progress at the top of the screen. You can access the download at any time by clicking up here. The time it takes to download depends on the speed of your internet connection. Typically, it takes between 10 and 20 minutes, but it can take longer if you're on a slower connection. When the download has finished, go to the Downloads section of your browser, and then your Downloads folder. You should now see the downloaded SPSS installation file. Right-click on this and choose Run as Administrator. It may ask if you want to allow the program to make changes. If it does, choose Yes. Please note that installing a new version of SPSS statistics may overwrite earlier versions. When the installer starts, press Next. Accept the terms of the license agreement and then press Next again. Leave the installation folder as is and press Next again. Then press Install. We've speeded up the video of the installation process. It normally takes between 5 and 10 minutes to complete. When the installation is finished, you'll see this screen. Make sure you leave this box checked, then click Finish. This will open the SPSS Statistics program. When SPSS Statistics opens for the first time, it will prompt you to license the program. Choose Launch License Wizard. When the SPSS License Authorization Wizard opens, select Authorized User License, then choose Next. Enter the authorization code you were sent by Hearn Software. Copying and pasting from our email is best, as it's very easy to make a mistake if you type it. Then press Add, then choose Next. You should see a green authorization succeeded message. Choose Next again and then finally Finish. SPSS statistics should then open successfully. However, the next time you need to use SPSS, you will need to locate it on your computer before you can use it. If you're on Windows 10, you can find the program by going to the Start or Windows icon in the bottom left of your screen and then scrolling through your installed apps. Find the IBM folder under I for IBM, and in there you'll find the IBM SPSS Statistics program. To run the IBM SPSS Statistics program, just click it and the program will open. If you need support for downloading, installing, and licensing SPSS, go to www.hearn.software and click on the FAQ link at the top of the screen. Select SPSS Grad Pack for Students by IBM, and you can then browse our FAQs which have answers to the most commonly asked questions about purchasing, installing, and licensing SPSS. If you can't find the answer you're looking for, click here to chat to us. We're online 24 hours a day, 7 days a week.